Good afternoon. Hi, Linda. So we, hi, how are you girls today? Good, how are you? Good, just kind of inhaled a little bit of lunch. <laughs> <laughs> we know that. We were just talking about that. <laughs> we were going to shove some jelly drops on here, and uh, since they said, oh, they smell good, I'm like, yeah, because you're hungry. <laughs> exactly, exactly. I used to have a girl that used to work for me years ago, and she would tell me, the car don't go with no gas, Linda. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's, that is exactly right. That's right. You got to have that, so, energy, that right. fuel for your energy. Yeah. Yeah. So welcome back. This is the third day and the final day of the conference. Time just flies. Um, a lot of great tips you've given us so far and people asking for all sorts of information and stuff. So, you know, I, I always say if we can help one caregiver, it makes me happy. But it looks like we're helping a whole lot more. That's awesome. Yeah. We have so we went ahead and emailed that to you, Linda, the list of uh, links, yeah. uh, if anybody's interested in any particular product, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got it, and I'll put it in the description when we, you know, once we edit the video. Okay. Super. Very good. Okie dokie, Artichoke, you girls are on. All right, perfect. Go ahead. Hello, it's Cindy and Christina again at Active Equipment Caregiving Corner. So today... We are talking about some just general living area things. We've got a lot of different things to talk about here. First thing up that we want to show you is called the foot bar walker. Now, this is a pretty new product, a new product to us. Um, when it was introduced to us, um, it was, wow. It was a life-changing thing. I think it's going to be a life changer for a lot of caregivers. And this is, this is why. A lot of times we see caregivers in the home we see a small caregiver taking care of a tall, bigger individual. Usually a lot of times it's the wife taking care of the husband. Sometimes those clients can walk once they're up, but getting up is a huge issue. The football walker is made just for that. So this is a walker designed with an extra bar right here on the top. It also has this little foot bar right down here. So I, as a caregiver, would put this in front of my loved one. I am gonna hold in the middle of this bar. I'm going to place my foot on the foot bar. And I'm gonna get in a stance position just so that I am giving a little bit of resistance here. So Christina put one hand on each side of the bar. And what she's gonna do is pull up from a seated position. So go ahead, uh, pull yourself up there. And you'd be amazed at the, the little bit of effort that I have to give on my, my part. Now, have, having been a therapist for many years, Getting people up out of a chair when they need a lot of assistance is tough on a caregiver. This is amazing how little assistance you have to give and how much weight actually they can put. So go ahead and sit down and kind of lean back. Yep. So I am not having to do a lot here. And she's, she's kind of leaning back like she's skiing. So um, this foot bar walker is, is a very nice invention. Um, you know, it's going to be very helpful for our caregivers especially those, again, that are having those people now. As a therapist, I want to say, we always try to train our clients to actually push up from a seated position. But inevitably, there's going to be those ones that just can't do that. Well, this is going to be the solution. This is going to be the solution to those caregivers to take that weight off of them, help their loved one up, help that function, especially if they can actually get up, take a few steps to transfer or actually get up and use a walker once they're up. So that is the foot bar walker. Well, you know what? One, one woman said that the foot bar walker saved her from having to put her husband into a community. Yes, yes. yes. And that can be a pivotal point. I mean, think about it. If you can't get your loved one off the toilet out of their comfy chair, right. any, any seated position, if that's the only barrier, you know, between that and going into a, a facility, you know, this, this is something that's going to really change a lot of households, a lot yeah. of households, a lot of facilities, things like that. Yeah. So absolutely. All right. So next thing I wanted to talk about real quickly. So in my 30 years of being a therapist, I finally come to the realization that it's not very polite of me to wrestle my throw rugs and my area rugs away from my clients. So that being said, I uh, have tried out several different double-sided sticky tapes. I wanted to point this out. This is one that I really like. So if you like to throw rugs, like your area rugs, you know those are a safety hazard. What we want you to do is tape them down. Double-sided sticky tape 
this brand, and this is not a promotional brand. Actually, most of the stuff that we get, a lot of the times we buy ourselves, but this is for, this is X Fasten. It just happened. I like this brand. It's a carpet tape and it's the, the letter X Fasten. It's a double-sided sticky tape. What you do is you lay your, your rug down. You put this tape on it corner to corner, you know, cover all the areas. Then once you have it uh, taped down, then you just take this backside off, flip your rug over, step on it on the edges and it's down. This, um, we, we tried on our, in what it was, our uh, wood area floor, rug. Our, our wood engineered, floors, really uh, engineered, engineered, yeah, engineered floor. hardwood. And left it on for a month under an area rug, took it up, no residual. So that's what I like about this tape. It goes carpet to carpet, carpet to vinyl, carpet to wood. Uh, the engineered hardwood, so very good to have in your toolbox. Um, the other thing I wanted to mention about tape is if you have steps that are not clearly visible, you may want to get something bright like this. This is just duct tape to line the edges so that you can see. You may want to put something, now this is a non-skid glow-in-the-dark tape. Um, we were doing some filming over at my parents, they have some steps that go into their garage. The steps are gray, garage floor is gray. We marked them with actually just black tape and they went on and on and on about the difference it made in just being able to see those better. They didn't recognize that they weren't seeing those as well as they should. So think about that for your steps, the non-skid and something that's going to make them more visible. All right. Okay, so next thing I want to talk about is people on walkers. Um, a lot of times when you're on a walker, it's difficult, of course, to carry things unless you are using a what we call a rollator walker. That's the one with, that has the seat and the four wheels. But there's a lot of options for the walker. This is one actually right here. This is a walker tray, okay? Mm. And all it does is it goes right over. So it has a couple of cup places but it goes right over the top of the walker and it allows you to carry your oh, food that's items. fabulous. Yeah, Carrie, this is, this is really something that I, that I like a lot. Um, there are also walker baskets, okay? So this basket is just something that will Velcro onto the front of the walker. I see a lot of people with those. Um, there's all kinds of bags. There's all kinds of things for the walker, but you really want to get something that's going to help transport those things, kitchen items, bedroom items, anything. Um, you don't want to put a lot of weight on the very front of the walker. So that's another thing that I like about this tray is it disperses that a little bit. More. Yeah. Okay. And that being said, I just wanted to mention in the kitchen, if someone is working in the kitchen, if a loved one's working in the kitchen, think about, you know, if they're on a walker and they don't have a tray or, or, or something like that, think about putting a midpoint. So let's say from the refrigerator over to the table, put something, put a chair, put a bar stool, put something as a midpoint that they can reach from the refrigerator and they're putting their stuff here and then they're walking over and they're putting their stuff from the midpoint over to the table or wherever it's going to. About a midpoint as well, if you need to. Um, okay, uh, next thing I wanted to talk about, oh, on walkers, and I know most people probably are aware of this, but just, you know, with the, with the wheeled walkers, the, the function of those, what we want to, to kind of work toward as far as walking with the wheeled walker is a more normal walking pattern where you're stepping through rather than lifting the walker and stepping to, and lifting the walker and stepping to. So we're, we're trying to encourage a more normal walking pattern. On those walkers, you don't wanna forget some type of a glide on the back uh, part of those walkers. So you have the wheels on the front. You don't want the rubber tips on the back. You want some type of a glide. You may see people with tennis balls. You may see people with these little, what I call skis. Um, there are some little discs, but some type of a glide on the back of that walker. Um, one other thing to remember, though, is when you have a hard plastic glide like this or disc, if you take it outside in the gravel, it is going to get roughed up. So you have to watch when you come back in on your wood floors and your carpet, because if you have a real, a real crevice in here, 
it could it could leave a mark in your in your floor. So sometimes people will put little socks over them. There's things out there right now that actually ski that come with ski glides and then also covers for inside. I think we have a link for that on our mm -hmm. website as well. So just something to keep in keep in mind with that. Okay. Um, let's talk about oh car assist handle. Let's take a look at that. So this is a car assist handle. Um, we do home assessments and I have been amazed at the number of people that have, have really uh, taken a liking to this and actually didn't realize they needed it and actually felt like, oh, this is gonna make things easier. So basically what this is, is, is a handle that goes in the door latch. So the little door latch hook, this handle goes right in there and then it acts as a handle as you're getting in and out of the car, something that you can push on uh, to help yourself up and to help lower yourself down. So there's a lot of different types of these. This one happens to do several different things. It's actually made so that you can break a window. It's got a flashlight. And then I think you can cut a seat belt here. So you can um, roof your house. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can yeah. roof your house. That's good. <laughs> so it's an all in one. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, this comes in very handy. They're not very expensive, but it's called a car assist handle. Okay. All right. Um, Christina, you want to tell us about the jelly drops? Yes, yes. We're really excited about these. Um, I am so excited they're in the States. I yes, know. They've, I know. Been, they've only been here for a couple of weeks. They and yeah. they have these little pods, they come in a tray of what, 24? Yeah. And then they come in these little pods and each pod has five and I'll bring this up a little bit closer. Uh, but jelly drops just uh, are, are now available in the United States. What they are is they are 95% water. I'm gonna give that yep. to you. They're 95% water. They have electrolytes and they are used to help people maintain hydration. They're not to be in place of hydration, but to help with uh, hydration because they have um, the electrolytes in them and stuff. I'm going to bring this closer to the camera. You can see, oh. Linda. You know what it reminds me of, uh, and I said this in our video. It reminds me of uh, when we were kids. My mom used to make us uh, finger jello, so they put extra, put yeah. extra gelatin in it. That's what this is. When you bite into this, this isn't going to gush out into your mouth. It's like eating jello that doesn't melt in your fingers. Mm -hmm. And they wow. have different different berry flavors, um, and they have all kinds of different. Flavors. Yeah, it's yeah. it's uh, sugar free, uh, mm -hmm. vegan um recyclable re container which is great yeah and the electrolytes and, and it's gluten free as yeah. well so yeah. but you know are, you know how some people are so stubborn they don't want to drink enough water they don't want you know if you just put a couple of them next to their chair yeah. done it's That's a right. little treat you yeah. know and they come in that when the ones that come in a tray it's almost like you're offering them a an hors d'oeuvre or something yeah kind of a confection right mm -hmm. yeah. you offer it to him and it's the proof colors and everything yeah and boy the the young man that developed these linda he said when he developed them he took them to his grandma who had uh who had dementia and she was just out of the hospital with a uti he developed them and then offered them to her he said she ate like three in five minutes <laughs> so, oh my goodness. yeah so i mean this is really good yeah. for helping with hydration yeah the only thing is is you got uh, anybody who was swallowing that's right, right. Um, like, somebody oh, just oh. somebody just asked are, are these dye free They they said they're they have natural colors. Yes, yeah. what's on the okay. on the the okay. packaging. Yes, yeah. take right. that for what that's worth. Yeah, yeah. They have a really good frequently asked question section on their website as well. If you have other questions about it, and it's jellydropusa.com. Are you US? You could go to just jellydrop.com, and then yeah. you can either choose the UK or. Uh, States. Yeah. yeah, but again, mention the swallowing. I don't know yeah, yeah. So again, with the swallowing, if you have swallowing issues, make sure to check with your speech therapist. Check with your doctor before uh, you before you because they're really they're kind of slick. And so if you got any, even if it just gets away from you, it's good. It's the perfect size to get in your airway, and it can just lodge into yeah. your vocal cords. So just be very careful with them if your loved one has uh, any kind of swallowing difficulties. Yeah. All right. Next up, we wanted to talk about the functional hand. That's what this is right here. So this is um, this was developed by PT and OT um, for grip. So if you have difficulty with grip strength, if you have difficulty uh, just you know weakness in general, um, they developed this little nice tool, which can pretty much be used with just about anything. So basically. What it is, is you, you put your tool here, so whether it's a spoon, a pencil, a marker, you know, a toothbrush, a hairbrush, right in here, and then you take this cord, 
and you're gonna pull it tight. So let me put this back in here, just like this. You pull this, this, this cord tight, okay? And then you have a built up grip right here. Any type of thing that you that you need. Now this company, and we'll talk about Easy Hold next. They do a lot of stuff together. I'll tell you what: the the two alone and the two together are a wonderful, wonderful product with anybody with with strength and grip issues and pain yeah. and, and things like that that needs something that's built up. Mm -hmm. um, the Easy Hold. I, I know we mentioned that the other day. I just wanted to show you. They have a whole variety of yeah. sizes of these i mean you can talk Perfect. about yeah for then these are for kids these are for adults just about yeah. anything but right across the whole gamut so yeah i'm watching you guys and i'm thinking did you ever work on the home shopping network <laughs> right <laughs> linda could you get us hooked up <laughs> if you're That's out right. there give us a call That's right. okay <laughs> qvc That's right. Yeah. all right let's let's go with a, a lifting vest here <laughs> All right. Whoops. Ooh, I'm sorry. That's sorry. right. I got you. Um, so sorry. next thing up is this is the lift vest. Now this is another type of uh, product that is going to help you with your loved one. Um, it can be worn like this over clothing. But what basically we're going to show you is this has multiple different handles that you can use to assist your loved one up. So if you have, if you need to give your loved one a little bit of assist, let's show you here. So if you have to give your little your loved one a little bit of assist, um, you can you know take a handhold here. You can take a handhold here. So if I needed to help her up, let's say she needs just a little bit of my assistance in getting up. Okay, so we're going to stand on three, Christina. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, and I'm just going to use this handhold. Now you can't actually see me, but there's one here on the side. There uh -huh. are a couple here in the front, and there are actually a couple up here. Um, this this is nice for the taller person, um, and oh yeah, there's there's a couple on the back of this vest as well. Um, this is something you know I'm thinking about if someone has to if a caregiver has to do a lot of transfers during the day, um, and they don't want to leave a gate belt on, you know this vest can be left on. Um, to yeah. Wear over clothing, something like that. So that's a that's a very nice uh, item mm -hmm. and. Speaking of that, oh, and we forgot to mention this too. Speaking of that, on their website, this is covered mm -hmm. by Medic Medicare. Uh, yeah, they've got a they've got a medical necessity uh, printout that you can print out uh, mm -hmm. that will help get Medicare co coverage for. Oh, cool! Yeah, yes. CPT code for it and everything. So yes, yes. Make sure you stop by their the easy easy lift vest dot com mm -hmm. stop by there and uh, check theirs out mm -hmm. and um i want to bring some attention to because we forgot to mention the footbar walker mm -hmm. does have some information on their site and it's the footbar dot com yeah they have some information on their site about insurance mm -hmm. i know they're working on medicare mm -hmm. as well um, but you can you can now use your uh, health savings account money to oh, yeah. uh, purchase to help yay you. yes yes that's awesome yay. awesome 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 yeah all right, so let's talk about, um, oh, those clothing, mm -hmm. yeah, clothing protectors. Here's a clothing protector. This is by the same company from the Easy Lift Vest. They make these uh, clothing protectors. Some people call them bibs. Uh, I prefer to call them uh, clothing protectors because there's a little bit more dignity in it. But what it is, it's just a, it's just a uh, plastic lined a uh, piece of material that closes, mm -hmm. ties in the back. Here. It's got a crumb catcher down here, and they each nice. they've got like four of them. And one of them has a necktie, and the other one I think is like a polo <laughs> shirt kind of thing. This one's got some pearls with a lovely little brooch over here. So, nice. um, yeah, these are really super nice. They're they're nice and long, and they're they're relatively breathable too. I mean, so if you when you can wear them and while you're traveling or mm -hmm. wherever you need to. Yeah. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. And these are an easy lift. Uh, easylift.com yeah yeah let's talk can we talk about the yep. meal lifter? next thing we have is um the meal lifter that's my it. other fame that's right yes this thing is amazing um what it does is it raises the plate i got a plate here it raises the plate about nine inches so when people have uh, essential tremors or parkinson's it helps shorten the distance from the plate to the mouth so it gets, it helps me get more food in my mouth if I've got those tremors. Uh, whereas if it's down towards the table, the chance of me getting 
more food in my mouth decreases because it's a, the further distance. So it just, it's, it helps people with dignity. I mean, it's just huge. Yeah. Because sometimes people, they're embarrassed. Um, and, and, and so they stop eating altogether, you know, because exactly. they, don't want, they don't want to, uh, it's just, I mean, eating. It's embarrassing. You know, yeah. It is, it's embarrassing. And it's such a social, uh, social time when yeah. you eat, it's usually social. And so um, this is such a great, this is dishwasher safe. Uh, maybe I it. say it's a this is a great invention. So, and I want to touch on something else while we're talking about um, essential trimmers. There's a cup here that's called a Kennedy cup, and what this is, it's got a, a lid on it, and then there's a collar right here that goes down inside the cup, and then you screw the cup, you put the liquid in, screw the lid back on, and then if you if you spill the cup, the liquid doesn't spill out of the cup. This is wow. called a Kennedy cup. Yeah, so this is super nice. The dishwasher safe. These are really nice. Mm -hmm. um, along that same line, mm -hmm. we want to talk about, let's talk about these two items yeah. here. Okay. Yeah. So we also have along some of the trimmer, uh, uh, that products for yes, helping product the trimmer. I can't talk today, obviously. Um, so this is a fork, but it's a weighted fork. And actually what you can do is you can adjust the weight because these are washers in the, oh. the handle of that. So you can adjust the weight needed in that utensil. And this, of course, comes in a full set, uh, but that's a nice product. Yeah. Um, the other thing is, is this little glove, okay? So what you do with this is you're putting this on the back of your hand. You're attaching it. Let's see here. So it's basically sitting on the back of your hand. It's adding just a little bit of weight to whatever activity, whether that's, you know, using a computer mouse or... Writing or oh, uh, using so, yeah, so it's just a little bit of weight to help with that uh, trimmer. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, um, let's see. We talked about let's talk about this right here. Yeah, uh, this is a magazine. Uh, it's called Mirador Magazine. We did a video on this one as well. Um, what this does is that you can get this as for subscription. It comes out about quarterly, I think, uh, every year. Um, and what it does is it's nice pictures uh, and you can use it with a loved one that maybe might have some difficulty with like reading or maybe vision. Um, if you go on to, when you get a subscription, every subscription comes with the actual print version as well as going online. There's actual an online version. On the online version, every article has been recorded by one of the staff members and it's their voice reading the article out loud. This makes for some really great um co like co activities you know so i could read this we could read this together we could both sit here and look at it together and look at the pictures together and then play the the audio uh, the audio track to the to the article uh, this this is a really beautiful and it's a beautiful magazine it's just the way they've got it all laid out with the colors and everything and it's yeah. not it's meant for adults it's meant for adults it's not childish and uh, this is just a great magazine to, uh, to subscribe to. So that's mm -hmm. called Mirror Door Magazine. Mm -hmm. And okay, so I think, I think we have covered pretty much what we were gonna cover today, Linda. We wanted to leave just a few minutes. If anybody has any questions, mm -hmm. you know, we have a lot of things. We've, we've covered a lot of things. Um, we just want people to know that if you are needing help, please ask for help. Mm -hmm. You know, yes. whether it's reaching out to your area agency on aging, uh, don't forget about your local lending closets. Mm -hmm. um, if you right. don't know where one is, again, reach out to your area agency on aging. And the locator for that is Elder? Elder Care Locator. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Elder on Care. the internet. And then you type in your zip code and it tells you where, where your local area agency on aging, which one serves your area. So mm -hmm. that is a great and resource for seniors and people with disabilities. Yes. And when you reach out for help, you're reaching out because you're strong, not because you're weak. That's exactly right. That's exactly, That's exactly right. right. And, yeah. you know, and don't forget, talk to your primary care physician as far as getting a referral for physical therapy, occupational therapy, speech therapy. Mm -hmm. We're here to help, you know, yeah. if you don't talk to your doctor about it, mm -hmm. there's not a lot we can do. We yeah. can't get to you. Yeah. And, you know, uh, Linda, one thing that we are running across as a small business, and I just wanted to point this out, is there are so many good caregiver resources out of the, out, out there. Sometimes, though, being a small business, it's hard to get ourselves out there saying, hey, we're here to help. We're here mm -hmm. to help. So right. that's, you know, we have to have people asking. We have to have people 
communicating with each other. Mm -hmm. Caregivers are a wonderful resource for the, for each other, mm -hmm. you know, and really sharing that information because we have in our networking have met so many wonderful people that support caregivers. Yes, yes, just like you. <laughs> and, and all our other friends. That's, that's exactly right. right. And trying to get those resources out there is the, the biggest hurdle for us, mm -hmm. you know, just letting people know that we are here. Mm -hmm. um, I just got a message from Nancy Morris. Oh, yeah. Hi, <laughs> Nancy. Hold on a sec. So Nancy Morris is the inventor of the football walker. Yes. And she said, uh, da, 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 da. our website has a whole section dedicated to insurance, HSA, FSA, and Medicare Advantage. Yes. So yes. that's what we got so far. And yes. Uh, yes. we'll just keep working on it. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. And could exactly. you please say, one person asked again, what is the name of the weighted glove? What is the name of the weighted glove? Okay. It is called Candy Things. Okay. So that is the website that I got it from. It's candy, H-A-N-D-I, things.com. Okay. Okay. And then just check out the sizes. I think this one is, it was a large, but check out the sizes there. Yeah, but yeah it's handythings.com and it's a hand weight is what it's called. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. And so for everybody that's listening, all this information will be in the show once it's edited and I get it out to everybody because everyone that is registered for the conference within two weeks after the conference, you'll receive 21 videos of the conference. Wow. So you'll be able to go back and look things over and show your friends and just share the love. That's right. <laughs> all right, ladies. Fabulous seeing you as always. We'll talk yes. soon. All right. Thanks. Thank Take you. care. God bless. Have a delicious day.